Hi, this is Rap Rap Takas Takas, 23 years old, from Cagayan de Oro City, and this is my story. Growing up, I wanted to be successful and to be great. I always dreamed of becoming a renowned medical professional so that I could have the resources to own everything. The house, the car, the material luxuries, and even to make a name for myself. However, my idea of success was challenged in high school when I was invited to join my community's summer camp called Kairos. There, I had the opportunity to talk to God like He's someone very close. Praising and worshiping Him for the first time made me believe that He is real because I truly felt Him at that time. I have never experienced anything like it even though I knew God beforehand. So I wondered, could there be more? When I entered college, I was introduced to a prayer meeting of Christ Youth in Action, or CYA. I heard powerful testimonies of God's mercy and love in that prayer meeting. And I realized that this was the answer to my question before. Truly, God has more in store. I saw how CYAers were so willing to give up their lives for God because they too had a personal experience of Him. I was inspired to live that way also. I started leaving behind initial ideas of success and tried living for God instead. Through CYA, I gradually realized that I wanted to waste time for God, not myself. Only when I did that did I experience life to the full. I dedicated my remaining years in college to be at service to the Lord and to others. I started sharing my personal experience to other young people so that they too may experience God. I made myself available at any given opportunity. And I always kept in mind that this life would be for the cause of spreading God's love and fullness. And so after graduating from college, I decided to become a full-time campus missionary, giving up my desire to become successful with the world's riches, since what God desired for me was the riches of His kingdom. By going to different places, journeying with young people in the universities, the Lord brought me to fullness of life. Even after mission work, God kept pouring out His fullness to me. I was offered a government job where the schedule isn't that tight, and I could still earn enough to help my family while still being available for the mission. And this increased my desire and conviction all the more to serve the Lord and be available for Him whenever, wherever. And who would have thought that life before, riddled with things done out of foolishness for the world, could be saved to receive life to the fullness? All because of grace, all because of God's fullness of love. And that is my historian.